you guys. What's up, Taurus? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours and leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe. Alright, also if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's for it as well. Okay. Alright, so also I'm going to um, do a free dream interpretation that I can't do for everybody, but I'll do as many as I can. So if you're, uh, it's, it's really cool. It's like a message from yourself. Like you're, it's just, it's wild. Anyways, um, check out my website. I'm going to try to update it before, oh shit, before I post this. Alright, so Taurus, wow, you got amazing cards. The Four of Wands, Six of Cups, and Nine of Cups. You got a whole lot of <sighs> happiness. There could be like a situation where a kid was involved, maybe two. I don't know, it looks like a lot of happiness, stability. Show me that Four of Wands for Taurus. For the immediate future. Show me the, uh, thank you, the higher scent. That's your energy. Oh, something ended for real, for real. I don't know what that was. I don't know what that has to do with this. But there's, a, this is a lot of stability. But then we also have, like, a situation for some that may kind of end it and is, like, unresolved. Tell me more about this, um... This could be a marriage, something long term, but it looks like that's kind of where you're, what you're looking for is, um, that monogamy, that, uh, it could be some of the spiritual relationships, home. Alright, tell me, thank you, the Queen of Pentacles. Alright, I just <laughs> keep getting your energy. Yeah, it's very solid, but I'm not getting a lot of, Shoot, information. Alright. You're creating a lot of stability. Whatever you're working on. This could be like plans to build a house, a family. Um, it's kind of like in the startup stages. For some, there's a job opportunity that's coming. And I don't think you see it. Because with this, it's like... Um, it could be in regards to that unresolved issue or something like that or just a situation like there's a lot of confusion with this and not knowing how something's going to move forward but there's an opportunity coming for some it's a job all for like a collaborative project something like that but what you're building is like a lot of stability you're taking care of yourself inside out you could be <clears throat> working on your finances and then, you know, going to get a pedicure or, you know, it's it working out. It's like a lot of self-care. Tell me about that opportunity for Taurus because it's a lot of stability. Like if you're trying to grow a business or something, you're definitely in the, um, the cards are lined up well for that. The King of Cups. Okay. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy, the Eight of Wands. So especially, even if you're single, this person is like, you could work with them, especially if you work um, in healthcare. This person is incredibly, like, attracted to you, like, finds you really beautiful. For some, you could be, like, married or just really working on that stability. But they're... Is a lot of focus on self love, but there's also new new love that's starting up here. Um, it really kind of looks like this person is approach like really nervous to approach you. If this is a past person, I mean there could be a reason, but if it's a new person, they probably come off like more than your or like just a really good friend. 
show me this um, six of cups. So for some with the six of cups, this is a person coming back. And I'll tell you what it is if it's not a person coming back. But it's been a while. Um, somebody may have had a work on their finances. Uh, but this also, there could have been some pain that was caused. So whatever this is, it took a long time for this offer to come. It's probably taken a while for, like, if this is a person. Show me this Knight of Pentacles. There's a lot of growth happening around you. Like, financial and otherwise. The Empress. You're, that's enough. So, the Empress is a combination of all these queens put together. And it does feel like... You're finding like a lot of love with the Empress associated with Venus, which is literally the planet of romance. You could be starting a family, but this person is definitely very into you. You're going from the Queen of Pentacles, nine, and like all this good stuff over here, and then you're ending the Empress. So, this offer that's coming. Um, it looks like after a lot of self-growth, but it brings a stable opportunity. This could be a new home. This is, um, tell me about the Knight of Pentacles. The judgment. For some, there's a reconciliation. But whatever, either way, it brings, it shines a light on a situation. There's like an awakening. Yeah, you're manifesting this. You are like doing your damn thing. It's like you focused on yourself and that's paying off in a major way. Show me this um, Nine of Cups for Taurus. For the outcome, please. The Nine of Wands. Don't let anything hold you back. Because it's uh, for some, you're just working a lot, so you're tired. But also with the Nine of Wands, there may be like a situation that, what is the Nine of Wands? And that's why you got to take your time, that you're struggling to move past. This could definitely be a person, I don't know how the fuck this just changed like that, but the, nine, the Five of Cups and the Seven of Swords. Somebody ends up, whatever this is, there could have been like a third party situation. There could just be somebody that's kind of sneaking to get to you. Because this whole thing just changed all the way up. Don't let this pull you back. Because it, it might try to. It looks like somebody was like deceitful in some way. This King of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sag, Energy. But like I said, this could have been a married woman. There could have been a third party involved. You've been really focusing on yourself. Definitely could be like single. So don't let anybody get you caught up. But what's... This is, whoever this situation is, with this outcome, you need to keep focusing on self-love because this is going to pull you back, weigh you down. It's going to lead to disappointment. Somebody's going to end up, like, paranoid as hell. This just completely switched up. That's what this was. See things clearly for what they are. Don't ignore anything because this thing just changed all the way up. I mean, this could be a person that's really just struggling to leave like an ex or something like that. Especially, you know, if you've been doing like a lot of focusing on yourself. Because it looks like this person, if that's the case, this person would want you. And, you know, they're really regretting some shit now. This, whatever, either way, however this is going, it's leading to someone... Disappointed, paranoid, and almost like, you know, it's either like a person trying to fix something with you, they're trying to heal it, or vice versa, because there could have been a married person involved on either side here, male, masculine, or feminine, and geez, it depends on your situation, but the fact that we have you over here, like, bossing up so much, Focusing on self-love, career, really growing something stable. It may have taken you a while to move forward, but also, you know, you're manifesting. You're incredibly beautiful, sitting in your power, and then you're rising to the empress. You're manifesting. 
make a sound decision. Because this over here is either an ex like really regretting and worried now. Or, you know, if there was like sneaking, then it's kind of just coming to a halt. So take it. Can't really see like this much growth. It just looks like somebody's stressing or worried, kind of going back to that ending that we've seen at the beginning. <laughs> so take it how it resonates because this switched all the way up, but you are bossing up on a whole other level. So don't let anything pull you back. Mm. Alright Taurus, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading or a phone reading, that's below as well. Also, if you're interested in the dream interpretation, um, check out my website. I'll try to have it updated by the time I post this. I can't get to everybody, obviously, but I will do what I can. Alright Taurus, talk to you guys later. Bye.